Hello there my fellow Holotable heroes and welcome to another Swagger video. So I'm back here with another fleet guide. So in this one I'll be showing you how I completed the discarded doctrine. So there's the journey guide fleet master in which uh, wh whenever you complete bonus tier you get 10 blueprints uh, for Piet's new executor command ship. And I've posted like a quick uh, first impressions uh, video for executors if you're interested in that. There'll be a link in the description below, as well as to my Swagger for Life tool where you can see all my other fleet guides. But now let's get into the battle and let me explain you how this one goes. Um, so I'll be starting with this Bounty Hearts lineup with Razor Crest, IG and Houndstooth. I really wish they would have given us Xanadu blood here, but they didn't. And then as the reinforcement, I'm bringing in uh, Boba's uh, Starfighter as well as Imperial Thai Bomber. Now in terms of relics, everybody is just minimum relic requirement, whatever they, they were needed. So Piet Relicade, uh, Boba Relicade, then IG Houndstooth, the pilots are Relic 5, and finally my best Carmandalorian here, he's Relic 3. So these are the relic levels that I used to complete this a couple of times already. Uh, luckily I had some crystals saved up, so I have now, uh, I had one crystal just enough for another further attempt. So I just go in and let me show you how I'm doing this. So we're facing Malevolence here. It's slightly unfair because they start with four ships, whereas we only have three. So definitely a little bit unfair treatment there. But anyway, uh, let's get first breach over on Hyena Bomber. This is just so that we will be able to later when uh, exec Executor gets a turn to do a mass attack on him. Uh, then let's go as well put it on Soldier get a stun and then finally as well here what you want to do is call um, Houndstooth to assist so then he cleanses the buzz droids of himself um, so when they target him obviously that he can survive long enough and here because we do have breach on Hyena Bomber we can just go ahead and do a mass attack here there we go there we go IG there uh, will double tap on the enemies with breach okay then they get to do a couple of attacks and because Hyena Bomber is a crueler ship, uh, when, whenever it taunts, we can actually ignore its taunt. Uh, so we'll just keep working on Geo Soldier, you know, because he can assist and everything. Alright, as you can see, we, we even marked him now, so that no issues whatsoever. Uh, so here, let's bring in uh, Boba. So just if you need a reminder what Boba's reinforcement does, uh, it will gain taunt, retribution and protection up, as well as critical hit immunity. Uh, and then they will as well gain additional protection up. So we have only one breach enemy, so we'll be getting additional protection up. And then we will ability block the target enemy, uh, which at the moment uh, is Hyena Bomber. Okay, there we go. And because we can, we can just ignore the taunt over there, uh, we can just now try and land the ability block over on IG, as well as breach, perfect. All right, they got buzz droids again on Houndstooth. All right. Okay, we'll have a cleanse in a moment with Executor when we get a next turn. Okay, all right. So let's just turn our attention back to Geo Soldier so we stop his assists and everything. All right, here we go. So payout triggered, contract triggered, whatever you want to call it. Uh, now we've got seismic charge ready to use. Let's just go ahead deploy it. And here, uh, let's obviously heal up Houndstooth, because he's not looking too healthy there. Alright, then they have another round of uh, buzz droids now. Let's try and finish off Soldier. That's where I'm really missing Xanadu Blood, because with Xanadu Blood on the field, we will be doing bonus damage uh, to breached uh, breached uh, enemies. Alright, so the Burning Sunfack as the reinforcement. Um, so what I want to do is actually just keep going after Hyena Bomber. He's almost out, so might as well finish him. Everybody got target locked, so this should be a big mess. AOE there, there we go. Trying to get Hyena Bomber out. Let's bring in our second and final reinforcement. Uh, Thai Bomber. Just dispel those uh, stacks of overcharge. Okay, we're still hanging in there. There goes Hyena. Let's start working on Sunfak. Uh, another seismic charge ready to be used. Perfect. 
Okay, um, again, let's call here. Who do we want to call to assist? Let's call IG for a double tap. One hit, two hit, there he goes. Okay, and now we can do one big mass attack over on IG that took care of IG and only down to last remaining Vulture Droid. And there we go. That's how I completed this already a couple of times before I record this video. So it's a pretty straightforward uh, match. It just takes a little bit, um, you know, that you burn through because those guys are very tanky. Plus they start with four ships on the field versus your three. I didn't even need to use my ultimate this time. That's how quickly we took them out. Alright guys, I hope you find this video useful and helpful showing you how I'm completing here uh, this bonus tier. As you can see from my blueprints, uh, I completed it three times. I'm out of crystals for now, so I'll have to wait until it comes back next time. And as well, you know, as many crystals I'll save up, probably I'll have another couple of attempts ready uh, to go. But until then guys, thank you for watching, I'll see you in the next one. Have fun, enjoy your life and may the RNG be with you my friends.